Thailand that he brought. We're going to look at the sex slaves in Thailand. There's slavery going on all over the world, and we're going to ban it all. And that's India. Libya. India. That's, that's oh, India as well. The reason why India they're eliminating India as well. 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 The point is, is that. Let's say rap raven and a lot of talk is white supremes from white supremes. I don't think no black people enslaved in Libya are talking about white supremes. They're dealing with what faces they're dealing with. Do you understand? Now you know my narrative is that it's Sunni slavery. Now you don't agree with that particular thing. What my point is, is that when you like say, well, white people invaded here, there and everywhere, and they contributed to the slavery. Not everywhere where white people have invaded have they then set up a black slave market. So there must be something consistent for 1,200 years that this specific group call themselves Muslims, the Sunnis, have been enslaved in battle. 1,200 years. Isa, 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 Isa. When man talking about, when man talking, I, I, I don't think Sunnis or or Shias as um, as individual human people are free from racism. Yeah, I think both. If you look in the history, they've had people that was racist and done bad things to black people. Saying that, yeah, saying that, yes, hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent. And we're talking about slavery, and I'm saying that when we're looking at Libya, yeah, under Gaddafi, yeah, there was not the slave trade and trafficking that we're talking about now. It was, it was the British. One minute, one minute. Exactly. Why are we talking about Britain? It was the British and their foreign policy and playing world police, yeah, that took out Gaddafi and left the back for the slavery in Libya right. No, 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 British and Americans. They've left loads of vacuum. But not everywhere they left the vacuum did the people set up a black women's slave market. So what they're selling, so it's a market. It's a market that they're selling black people there from plastic in their holes. Okay, okay, so let me ask you one minute. So in relation to what he said about Shia and Sunni in history, the Zanj Rebellion, you heard of the Zanj? No, I haven't. They were stolen from Africa by the Sunnis and it was a Shia, Ali bin Mohammed, who put the Zanj and the biggest slave rebellion ever. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not denying that. I'm saying, 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 to divert from British um, oppression. If we're talking about British oppression and someone brings up Libya, that's a diversion. First, no, no, one diversion. minute, stop, man. Stop, bro. Yeah? It's a diversion, yeah? And that's why we call it a far-right tactic, because any time we're talking about Britain, people want to divert to Libya. Yeah, that's the first thing. The second thing is, I want to know, apart from using using our people's, um, our people's slavery as a talking point to divert, and, and get at Sunnis or whatever, what have people done about the Sunni exactly. nation? That's what I want to know. Alright, exactly. so number one, there's no diversion tactic from me. In relation to the Sunni slave trade, the ideology of the Sunni comes before you enslaved. Isa, 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 Isa. Isa, you might have a point, but it's not relevant. Isa. Right now, I'm, right now, I'm, I'm, I'm asking. I'm asking. Isa, you have your own agenda. Apart from using it as a talking point to point at the people. What have they, what have they done? What have you done about the Syrian slave trade? So don't tell me fuck off. Listen, I'll say it again. When people are coming at me and saying, you're a sellout, your people enslave black people in Libya because I'm a Muslim. Am I supposed to align myself with them and say, okay, we Muslims Obviously are doing not, that? Yeah. Likewise, likewise, when people say, why do you beat yourself as a Sunni? What do they say? No, that's the Shia. So I always have to make the distinction. And I'm asking, say, what have you done? Outside talking, what have you done? Telling you, what have you done? I'm I'm done? I'm I'm don't interrupt. Right, so as I'm saying, the same way how he's Tarketing done his work. Right, he can't talk nothing here. The same way how he's going <laughs> and protesting. <laughs> if black people <laughs> stop joining Sunnism <laughs> and fighting for ISIS, 
leaving the Caribbean fighting for ISIS, right. leaving that's England that's fighting for ISIS. They've done that. 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 They've done for these people using religion. You understand? Very simple. It's so simple. Man, it's simple as hell. You don't find Shia Black Shia with Black Shia goes to fight with you. My question is back. My question is, are we going to fight with you? 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 To point at Sunnis, what has Issa done nothing. to organise, mobilise against the nothing. Can one person in the audience have done nothing? Can one person have done nothing? Do you know what he's done? Blood clot, no. So, 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 but then be against the KKK. The there are hundreds. So you support the KKK right there. There are much bigger issues at hand, man. Are you explaining it to the black KKK? Are you explaining it to the black KKK? Are you saying that you support the KKK? Are you explaining it to the KKK? Are you saying that you support the KKK? I'm going to go one back here. You're the only back here I know. I'm going to go one back here. 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 There's loads all over the world. But they don't feel comfortable to come up and say, there's loads that come in. I give you all advice, man. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
have a shield. And, and I would say the same thing. I would say the same thing to a Sunni that comes here and start telling me about Shia, 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 Shia. I tell him, I don't want to hear about this. Yeah, I don't want to hear about that. What I want to hear about is what's going on with our people. Now, what I'm saying is, when we're talking about the British Empire, because like I said, I, I have to talk about it as a talking point. I don't use my, my, my Libyan brothers who are being enslaved as a talking point to get at Muslims or get at Libyans or get at anyone. I talk about the Libyan protest, yeah, and the reason why we set that up is because we care about our brothers. We we'll do it in private and in public, yeah. We care about the brothers being enslaved. What I'm saying is, we can talk about that. We talked about it on my show the other day. But when I am talking about the British, I'm not talking about Libya, I'm not talking about Indonesia. I don't want to hear about the government. I don't want to hear about Libya when I'm talking about the British government. Unless man's going to talk about how, Britain, how Libya created the, how the British created the vacuum of what we see in Libya today with their world police. Yeah, and, 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 they, and they went there saying they, they're getting rid of an oppressor. But one minute, one minute, one minute. The British, the British, listen, talk about the British. The British and the Americans went to Libya because they said they were getting rid of an oppressor, right? An oppressor that gave. Um, one minute, that gave money to the, um, to the people when they got married, an oppressor that was going to put the currency of Africa under the ground, an oppressor yes. that was going to put, uh, put a satellite in the air for the whole of Africa. This is the oppressor they give One minute, free electricity, all right. So that oppressor gave you what free electricity over here in the first world, Britain. Yeah? So when they got rid of that oppressor, okay, you got rid of an oppressor. But then now, as you say, it's worse. And they are making no. Exactly. No, um, the chance is to go over there. So, so, that, so that means that even on the African continent, when we're discussing going back to our homeland, yeah, we have to study how the British um, Empire pays war police, and even in our homeland, when we're trying to better ourselves, they get involved and stop progress.